Hello, welcome back to another grocery haul. So today's video is from Morrison's again. And actually, my husband gets um ten percent discount because he's a lecturer, he's a teacher, he's a lecturer, and we never have really used it. But this is the second week that we have gone to Morrison's. Well, my husband went again this week, and it's amazing. It saved we saved quite a bit of money. I think it was like six pound that we'd saved this week from this week's shop, which is obviously over the month is going to add up to quite a bit. So, I think maybe we'll just go to Morrison's a bit more now, and maybe use that as more of a regular shop. But anyway, I, I was going to show you what we got. So first of all, look at these beautiful flowers. This is what my husband brought me today. It's Saturday. Tomorrow is Valentine's Day. Um, and he got these from Morrison's. They're absolutely gorgeous, absolutely stunning bouquet. Very, very spoiled there. Um, and then just for fruit and veg this week, we didn't need tons, but what we did need is some mango. So we just got the mango fingers. There's a pack of bananas there at the back and some salad onions. There's a cucumber. We needed some garden peas for the freezer and I needed some Granny Smith apples. I'm making apple pie porridge. So that, and you'll see that on the channel soon. So I needed some apples for that. We got eggs. Uh, we got these, which are the Go Ahead Fruity Cake Bites. If you've not tried them, they're absolutely delicious. Honestly, they taste really nice. They come in like small packs and you get those little round dots, like little cake bites in them. And um, the raspberry and strawberry filled, they're really tasty. And they're only 97 calories, which is a bargain. Uh, if you're dieting like me, <laughs> um, they we got a sweet pepper salad that's for a side dish this week, um, and then we needed some more pasta. So we got this gnocchi. Well, my husband picked this gnocchi up. Some original sauce mango shower gel there as well, and then some bacon lardons. We're gonna do for tomorrow for dinner. We're gonna do a risotto with like lardons and garden peas and lots of onion and stock and wine and stuff so we're just gonna have like a risotto evening in for valentine's day so we've got bacon lardons and obviously the peas for that and then we needed some more risotto rice so just got a small bag there needed some eggs for banana bread and bacon my husband got this bacon so this is the british dry cured streaky bacon the smoked so he picked up a pack of that and i think this was a two for four with the sausages so he just got the basic chipolata british pork sausages on the two for four pound deal there we got some more of these bagels for we do pizza bagels in the week and it's a delicious breakfast or lunch so we've got another pack of those some thick soft white toasty bread from roberts i really like this brand i don't really eat bread i've said before but for the last couple of weeks i've just been loving toast and this is a really good brand i'm pleased with the bread um, we've got some carvery roast turkey, just got the one pack, that's all we needed. You'll see if you watched last week's grocery haul that this is what my husband found, these Rana um, Italian recipe kits and it comes like in a pack, let me see if I can open one. It's a three part kit, you just microwave it and it comes in a pack that you add your like the stuff all together to. So this is it opened up, we got the Tagliatelle one, you got two of those. And it comes with the pasta and then it's all numbered as well so that's obviously number one and then it comes with a dressing here which you just like a parsley seasoning it comes with some cheese which you add on at the end and then also some uh, of the sauce so you kind of put it all into this cardboard dish I'm not doing the best job here at describing it am i you put it all into this cardboard dish that it comes in and then you put it in the microwave so you obviously add the number one thing first then you add the number two number three and then number three again but i suppose that's four because it's like the bit the um parsley on the top but yeah it, it's he really enjoyed it for his lunch last week it's half term this coming week so i suppose he's not working but we're still stuck indoors so this will be a nice little lunch that he can have and you just pop it in the microwave for five minutes and in the cobble box that it comes in so it's a really handy little kit i think they were like three pound or 350 which is basically the price of a meal deal so i thought it was a good bargain so we got two of those the tagliatelle carbonara ones 
then we got this gorgeous tiger bloomer it smells insane in the kitchen here i love the smell of fresh bread and he's just come back with this from the bakery and it smells so good so we've got one of those for 80p we needed some pineapple slices for another recipe that i'm doing so we've got two tins of the pineapple slices here they're just the small tins but in the juice we've got two of those and then he found this which i um, must just be for a recipe that he wants to make i'm not sure what this is but it says southern fried bread crumbs so i'm guessing you just add it to chicken and we've actually got some chicken to use up so maybe we'll have southern fried chicken one night but yeah the pack so it's new apparently i don't know how much it was i'll ask him so this was a pound he's telling me but yeah this is southern fried bread crumbs in a little pot which is quite a cool little idea and then he also got these some squares for himself, the marshmallow squares, rice crispy ones, and some McCoys, salt and vinegar McCoys. Um, I needed another roll on deodorant, so he got me one of those. And then this is like all the bad stuff again. Well, first, sorry, first of all, we got this, this pizza, this stuffed crust loaded cheese Chicago town pizza for one night this week and then some milk and then this is kind of all the bad stuff so we'll start over here this is new i think mcvitties vibs classic caramel bliss biscuits i've not seen them before maybe they're not new maybe i'm just late to the party but these look so delicious so he got a pack of those i asked for these cadbury cornflakes because if you watch my grocery hauls you'll know that they're my favorite he's brought these back from morrison's i don't know they obviously don't sell the cadbury's version of them i'm not keen on them so they'll be for him but he's got two packs of those. They were two for three pound. I think I said milk already. And then I asked for like a Black Forest Gatto for tomorrow for Valentine's Day dessert. And he found me these two fresh cream chocolate and cherry muffins. I'm probably going to have both. <laughs> I'm probably not going to share. I'll say because he didn't get me the Cadbury's ones, I'm going to have those two. And he's just going to have to have them. <laughs> um, so he got them for tomorrow for Valentine's Day. And then I got some, he asked for Pepsi Max. So he got me some Pepsi Max here. You get eight in a in a case, I think. And then he got himself some Cherry Coke. You get six in a, in a pack there. And then I needed some baking stuff. So it's half term next week. My husband's not working, as I've said um and i'm just going to take the time to do a bit of baking and do some baking videos so i needed some just some cheap rice krispies so I, he got me the morrison's branded ones so i got a box of those i needed some self-raising flour so he got me a pack of that there i needed some cupcakes so he got these these are the rainbow cupcake cases i just asked for plain cupcake cases but these all look pretty anyway with the colors um I needed some baking powder as well so he got me a tub of that and then I asked for caster sugar and he said he didn't have caster sugar so he picked me up the granulated sugar and I don't think I can use this in baking I mean I will have a look but I'm pretty sure it's for like jams and like sweetening stuff um but yeah I'm not I'm not sure what happened there but I might have to go to another shop and get like a local shop and just pop in and get some caster sugar because that is not the right sugar that I need unless I can google it and it tells me I can use it in cupcakes we'll see um but that's the baking stuff I got and then cream eggs because we're making a cream egg rice crispy tray bake thing so there for that um he got himself some Robinson's real fruit squash orange and pineapple and then as we all know if you watch my grocery hauls i'm obsessed with orange juice in the morning i have it every single day so he got me two bottles of the orange juice with bits um marshmallows one for my jar because my hot chocolate like little not station but my hot chocolate jar my marshmallow jar for my hot chocolates is pretty much empty there's only five left so he got me two bags of them so one bag for making this rice crispy bake um to go with the rice krispies and then one bag to fill the jar the galaxy is for the rice crispy bake as well so once i've done it i'll probably vlog it and then you can see like what it looks like but it sounds delicious it's really unhealthy but it's half term isn't it so we're gonna have a lot of treats um and then i think that's it yeah that's the last thing so that's what we ended up getting it came to 60 pound now the, we've got like quite a bit of stuff in the freezer and the cupboards and stuff so there's not really like meal stuff i was just thinking as i was going through but it's because we're eating through our freezer 
we wanted to spend £40 this week, but I think with the baking stuff, it's kind of come to a little bit extra, but it's a activity to something to do in the week, so I'm not too bothered about that. But in terms of food, I think we've got what we needed to get for the week, and I'm quite impressed with it. I'm actually loving Morrison's. I didn't think I... I've not been for a while. Um, I didn't go again today. My husband did, but I'm liking what they've got, and the fact that we get 10% off is brilliant, but these flowers are such a little joy to receive as a little surprise, and they're beautiful, beautiful Morrison's flowers. But anyway, that is my grocery haul. So happy Valentine's Day for tomorrow. Thank you very much for watching the video. Please subscribe and like if you haven't. And I will see you on the next one. Take care. Bye.